What is the cost of creating thinking machines? Are they a substantial threat to our own existence? Aside from the science fiction and Hollywood log lines, intelligent machines are already having a disruptive impact on modern life. Is your job about to get automated? Software substitution, uh, you know, whether it's for drivers or waiters or uh, nurses or even, you know, whatever is you do. Those robots there have been dubbed Oshbots, and they're being tested right now. In a it has been projected that in the next 20 years, at least 45% of America's operations will entirely be automated. create some high tech jobs, but not enough to support the base of our economy. And what's to say that, like we've seen with other high tech jobs, that they won't be outsourced as well to, uh, to lower wage nations. Artificial intelligence will make it possible to disrupt the stable professions such as medicine, law, and even engineering. The cutting edge of programming isn't super smart programmers writing bots, it's super smart programmers writing bots that teach themselves how to do things the programmer could never teach them to do. The general rule is, if it requires memory and analysis, machines can do it better. One of the questions we asked was, by which year do you think there is a 50% probability that we will have achieved human-level machine intelligence? We defined human level here as the ability to perform almost any job, at least as well as an adult human, so real human level, not just within some limited domain. And the median answer was 2040 or 2050, depending on precisely which group of experts we ask. Now, it could happen much, much later or sooner. Like, truth is, nobody really knows. What we do know is that the ultimate limits to information processing in machine substrate lie far outside the limits in biological tissue. It's up to the human species to do what it has always done, adapt. Basically, non-routine cognitive jobs are now, according to research, in 10 to 25 years. Or die. Financial advisors, for example, that do this kind of work will also be replaced. Automation is moving up from the blue collar to the white collar. Technological unemployment is real. But can humans adapt fast enough? Martin Luther King already talked about the basic income guarantee. We may end up there faster than you think. We are demanding an emergency program to provide employment for everyone in need of a job. Or if a work program is impractical, a guaranteed annual income at levels that sustain life in decent circumstances. It is now incontestable that the wealth and resources of the United States make the elimination of poverty absolutely practical.